station early and buy some flowers so that we could enjoy a candlelit supper at the Frascati. But when I got home, I... Oh, I, I, sit, I, down, I, I sit down, sit down. Oh, 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 oh. Your wife, she is well. She is very well indeed. In fact, so well. Well, at last you did it also another man. No. Yes. <laughs> what deceit. I know it's true to say that I, Chief Inspector Otto, of the Orthodox Police and father of four, was humiliated by your infidelity. I too am humiliated, Inspector. But I am very glad that you have come here to seek solace and comfort. It is indeed solace and comfort that I need, Mother. <laughs> and comfort and solace you shall receive. I have never left you down before, and I will not begin now. <laughs> so, let me see. <gasps> what about... Angelique. The leather and the whip? Yes. Too strenuous. After seeing my wife today, no, I don't think the whip. Of course, of course. Hmm. What about Jacqueline? The plastic and the umbrella. And the rubber wellingtons. Too strenuous. <laughs> After seeing my wife today with another man, it has chilled me to the bone. Of course, of course. I am so insensitive. Oh, Inspector. I have just the person for you. What about Maddie Claire? The feathers. And the honey. Wonderful! Good Lord, <laughs> I'm so glad that I'm able to help you when you are of such need. She is a number nine window. Go straight in. <laughs> Thank you, madam. I am sure this will take your mind off the scenario at all. She's trained for that very thing. 